My name is Brian Hargrove. I am Executive Director of Sports Development at Visit Wichita. We are thrilled to host the event we're about to tell you about, in the, which showcases Wichita as an area to be able to host multiple events of many different magnitudes. This event has never been hosted in Wichita before, and it's sure to get your motor running. It's a thrilling time for sports in Wichita. This is one of now 16 events that Visit Wichita will be hosting in the year 2020. We have already hosted the U.S. Figure Skating Synchro Sectionals and the ECHL All-Star Classic. And we have many more events planned this coming summer. Just to highlight a few, next month we've got the NAIA Wrestling National Championship. Later this summer, we've got TBT, the basketball tournament, returning to Wichita after record-breaking attendances in 2019. And also this summer, we've got the USA Women's Olympic Volleyball Team playing matches here in Wichita, the only destination in the United States prior to going to the Tokyo Olympics. So it's very exciting. We have a busy summer ahead of us. At this time, I would like to introduce Bruce Richardson with Bar to Bar. Thank you very much. Uh, for the first time in the history of the state of Kansas, we are excited to announce that Bar to Bar MX Park, in conjunction with Visit Wichita, has been chosen to host the 2020 North Central Rocky Mountain ATV MX AMA Amateur National Motocross Regional Championship. <laughs> this prestigious event will be held June 13th and 14th with practice days on Thursday and Friday before the main event. There's only eight regional championship racetracks chosen throughout the entire country. It's been a goal of ours and many of our supporters for a lot of years to bring this prestigious, prestigious event to Wichita. These riders and athletes journeys start to the national championship as early as in February. Starting the qualifying process for the regional championship by qualifying in one of only 52 area qualifier races around the country. The regional championship is the final step these riders have to attend and qualify to go to the national championship, which is held every year, every summer since 1982 at the home of the country music star Loretta Lynn in Hurricane Mills, Tennessee. Bar to Bar is excited to showcase our national caliber racetrack. We're excited to showcase our national caliber city with over 700 athletes coming to town with their friends, their family, and support teams, it's sure to be an exciting week in the city of Wichita. They're gonna be staying at many hotels, eating in a lot of restaurants, and seeing what our great city has to offer. We can't wait for this energetic welcoming that the city's ready to roll out for these athletes and their families. There's plenty of ways for local businesses and volunteers to get involved through, through various sponsorship opportunities and much, much more. All this information and much more can be found on our website at bar2barmx.com. At this time, I'd like to introduce uh, one of those athletes, uh, event writer, Mr. Chris Kirk. Good afternoon. Again, like Bruce said, my name's Chris Kirk. I run the starting gate at Bar to Bar, along with I've raced about 30 years. Uh, I'd like to thank the city of Wichita and Bar to Bar for giving us riders the opportunity to have this in Wichita for all the local riders. Uh, in the motocross community, this is the biggest stage you can be on. And Wichita is known, like Brian said, for all the sporting events that Wichita hosts, and now we can add motocross to that event. Being held, there's thousands of motocross tracks within the United States, and being picked as the top, one of the top eight tracks in the United States is a huge showing for the dedication and commitment that Wichita and Bruce and Bar to Bar and their staff have to the sport of motocross. Motocross, to go to Loretta Lens, there's 36 classes that go to Loretta Lens that you can sign up in, from kids the age of four to people old as me over 50, and a whole bunch of in between. So, it is a very prestigious event. It takes 42 riders in each class. So there's thousands and thousands of riders who attempt to qualify. But if you do qualify, 
That means you come in, you're the top 42 riders in the United States in your class. And there's also several countries that also represent that come to Loretta Lynn's. So out of thousands of riders, if you were in the top 42, obviously that is a, that is a great, a great thing, a great accomplishment. I cannot stress the amount of time, dedication, money, support from families, tracks, sponsors, the city of Wichita for these riders to make it to Loretta's. And it is a great honor to have it come to Wichita. Uh, we have a great city. Uh, Bruce runs a great track. So we're gonna have a great time. Uh, everybody come out, it's gonna be exciting. See a lot of nice people, a lot of excitement. So again, come out, see it. It's gonna be a great time. Thank you.